The reason we decided to write operative techniques in orthopedic surgery four years ago was because we felt there were no texts specially directed toward how to do uh, the majority of operations that we commonly encounter in orthopedic surgery. Uh, once we decided that th there was a need, we then uh, identified subspecialty editors in all of the subspecialty areas in orthopedic surgery, such as spine surgery, reconstruction, joint surgery, hand surgery, and foot surgery. After that, each of these uh, subspecialty editors identified 50 to 100 uh, authors who then uh, wrote the chapters. The book is unique in that it has original illustrations, and in this case, there are over 10,000 new uh, pictures uh, that are in the book, and these are spread out among over 700 operations that we commonly do. Another uh, unique part of this text is that the authors come from all over the United States. In fact, we have some international authors. And instead of being just focused on one uh, university or one part of the country, they really represent uh, the best that we have to offer uh, throughout the United States and abroad. The best use of this text for either a resident or a practicing orthopedic surgeon is when they have decided that they are going to do an operation. Uh, it is not a text that will be used to decide when to do the operation or why they are doing it. Although these two pieces of information are covered in bullet form, the goal of the text uh, is the specific steps in the operation. It will be especially valuable for residents because the step-by-step -step fashion uh, that the procedures are described in reviews the anatomy. And as the residents uh, gain confidence, they will be able to follow each procedure, reviewing not only the uh, specific techniques in the surgical process, but also the anatomy that goes along with it. Operative techniques in orthopedic surgery is very beneficial for the operating uh, orthopedist in that it provides a review for all of the uh, surgical procedures that they will usually encounter. Most orthopedic surgeons on a day-to-day -day basis will not do one operation to a large uh, degree as far as repetition is concerned. So this text will enable the surgeon to look at each operation on a step-by-step -step basis as he encounters it. The uh, text was extremely uh, complex in that it involved a, a large number of people, but these were very capable, enthusiastic, self-directed individuals. And I enjoyed uh, working on this text because all of our uh, section editors were highly capable people, very expert in their uh, particular areas, and it was a real pleasure getting to know them both personally and professionally, and then the, uh, all of the friends that I made during the course of the uh, project has been invaluable. It's been especially enjoyable with the support that Lippincott has given us. I've written a number of other uh, books, edited a number of other books, and I've never had the involvement that I've gotten from uh, this company. And I really have enjoyed the process, and I appreciate what they've uh, helped us create.